Hi welcome back to the channel my name is Jonathan and today we're looking at the new ID card holder and card holder pro from OrbitKey. So who are OrbitKey? Well they're an Australian company and probably best known for their key organizer but they've also produced other products along the way and five of those have been funded on Kickstarter and together they raised nearly three million dollars. This ID card holder is the latest product and was also funded on Kickstarter and managed to raise a whopping $463,000 which tells me there is a market for this. OrbitKey are well known for putting a lot of effort into the design and this is no exception and also the quality. The company has an eye on the environment, there's an emphasis on using recycled materials and the leather here for example is all ethically sourced. Okay, what is it? Well, in short, it is a ID card holder on a retractable cord, but it is actually a little bit more than that. And there is a real emphasis here on design, so it looks great and quality, so it's really well made. There are two models to choose from. There's the standard and the pro. The pro has some additional functionality, which we'll get into, and it comes in two colors. You have the traditional black and you have this stone color here. And as you can see, the packaging is really nicely put together. So if you're thinking of this as a gift, then it presents really well. The pro packaging has a flip out card here because it's got more features and more of a story to tell. The packaging of the standard version is a little bit more simple, but nevertheless, both are really nicely presented and have a real feel of quality about them. So let's start first with the standard model. So here is the standard model. This is in the stone color, as you can see, and it consists primarily of the card holder itself and this retractable mechanism. This is a leather finish here, and you can see the stitching is of really high quality, and it just feels like a really premium, well-made product. The card holder here is designed to take an ID card and also a credit card, so it can be used as a very minimal wallet and the retractable mechanism here is custom made for this. It has an inlay here of matching leather and the cord here is made out of material called Dyneema. Dyneema is super strong and super durable and used a lot in the sailing industry. So this should really stand the test of time. You'll notice that it has a clip on the back of the retractable mechanism and that allows it to be clipped to a belt or a pocket or a skirt and you'll also notice that it rotates and it does that for good reason because when you've got it attached to say a belt and it's moving around like this then you'll find that the cord is always exiting from the hole here in a straight line rather than at an angle because if it's at an angle then it's creating some additional wear on the edge of this metal piece here. So the rotation effectively means that you get less wear and more durability. This mechanism is also super quiet and that's really nice to see as well. And then it has this unique feature in that if you want to hide your ID, say you're walking around town, uh, maybe doing some shopping, buying a sandwich, etc., then you can rotate it through 180 degrees and it holds in place. So if you don't want to tell everybody who you are and where you work, you can do that when you're out and about. And that's one of the unique features of this system. So here we have what might be an ID card in here. There's also this plastic window to protect it. And then you can add in a credit card. So let's just put that in there. And now you've got a payment system so you can do contactless payments really easily when you're out and about as well as carrying your ID. And that slides out really easily by just using that uh, thumb hole there. So that's really nicely done. You also then get a lanyard with it. This is made out of a really soft material and it has a little bit of stretch to it, which is quite nice. It's also got a breakaway thing here. So if somebody's trying to strangle you, it will break away. And then it attaches to this clip here. So it's all been thought through like this. So you just simply pull that through like that and now you've got a lanyard strap and you can swipe in and out of your lift or your building or make a payment and you have your ID on show unless you want to do that and hide it. 
So all really nicely thought through and works really well. Uh, let's compare this then with the Pro model. Okay, the Pro model looks the same from the top, but you'll notice it's actually quite a bit thicker. The standard is four mil thick, this is nine mil. So what do you get for that extra five millimeters? Well, you get a couple of things. One of the things you get is a secret compartment under here. And this is probably about three mil. So you won't get too much in there, but you will get some cash, say, and a key, for example. And then you can close that down and you've got it hidden away for when you need it. So that's a really nice feature. And there's a few things that could go in here. I'm sure you can use your imagination. You've just got to be careful you don't add too much weight because if there's too much weight on there, it pulls away from the retractor. So just be mindful of that. In addition to the hidden compartment, you also get a wallet space on the back that will take two cards. Uh, it's quite a tight fit so I can definitely say you're not gonna lose these you probably can't get any more than two in there but to get them out you've got the the thumb slot there you just slide that up there and then you can also slide the other one out there a really nice solution there so you got the benefit with the pro of the hidden compartment for keys and cash and then a couple of cards on the back there in addition to that, you'll notice the way it attaches here is different from the standard in that you've got this metal zinc alloy hook here. And that is because you can detach it and attach it here. And now you've got a way of carrying your ID landscape. And that might suit people, particularly if they've got it on a belt. This one also comes with a lanyard, which is color matched and has the same nice, slightly flexible material. Now, if you work for an organization that insists on you wearing their version of a lanyard, then that works as well because this clip on the back has been cleverly designed and has a narrow point here. And that allows you to attach this kind of standard spring clip onto it like so. And now you can use a standard lanyard in the same way. That works pretty well. There's one drawback with that though, and that is often these lanyards swivel on their own, and that will then negate the benefit of having this way of hiding your identity when you're out and about because the whole thing might swivel. So that's worth factoring in. But nevertheless, it can still do it, which is a bonus. And it would also take a split ring here as well if your company lanyard uses that as an attachment method. So who's this for? Well, I think if you have to wear ID day in and day out for work, then this is seriously worth considering because if you've got to wear this every day, you might as well buy into one that looks really nice and is great quality and is gonna last. And I think this one from Orbit Key ticks all those boxes. In addition to the fact that you've got some added functionality and you can use it as a minimal wallet or at least to carry a spare card for payments or some emergency cash, etc. And if you want to go a step further and take more advantage of it being used as a wallet, then go for the Pro and you've got more cards and the hidden compartment in there as well. In terms of pricing, I'm not absolutely clear on this at the moment because at the time I'm making this video, it's not quite being released to the market. It will be released in a few days from here. But my understanding is the standard one's gonna be about $55 and the Pro one's gonna be about $70. I think what you're paying for here is for something that's been really well thought out, has some unique features and is really high quality. Yes, I hope that's been useful. If you've enjoyed the video, please consider hitting the like button. It really helps the channel. If you want to see more about what Orbit Key can do, then check out this review of the Orbit Key Nest. Thank you as always for watching and I'll see you in the next one.